hey guys um so basically i didn't uh, really plan to make this video uh, i was thinking about it all day but i didn't really want to make this video because i don't really know what to talk about but i was like this this platform that i have of somewhat of an audience that i think i whatever people i have on this audience i'll, I'll i genuinely love them and i really i'm thankful to them for supporting me of on my journey and on this uh, channel basically and i think it's it's more than me just making you know these high quality fun entertaining videos i need i should be sharing a lot more than um all of that stuff so in in conjunction of all that i basically thought of uh doing this kind of thing every every sunday uh that i talk about uh, some of the stuff that's plaguing my mind and uh and don't worry it's not going to be always depressing stuff uh, i hope at least not but um this one certainly is because it's a really it's a really sad day uh for everyone um i don't know if you've heard you probably have the news came out today morning uh sushant singh rajput he was a bollywood actor fairly re i don't really call it recent but he's he was a, he was a, he I know he's not recent he's, he's he was in the industry for quite a while now and uh, yeah he was a, he was one of my favorite actors like if not if not the favorite actor like i loved i loved the guy i loved his acting and beyond his acting he just felt like a more multifaceted sort of guy because if you see his instagram posts and and stuff like that he was like really passionate about physics and uh, like he had like these like really cool bucket lists that he used to do and he wanted he, i think he visited cern once he visited nasa and uh, he used to do a lot of humanitarian work i just i loved it he was he was the one like he was one of the actors that i really really looked up to um but yeah unfortunately uh, today uh, today morning my dad told me that uh, he passed away initially i i didn't really my dad saw this post on uh, facebook and as with most of the stuff on facebook i don't really believe it because most of the stuff on there is fake anyways um but he told me today morning and i was i shrugged it off cuz i was like nah it's going to be it, it, all this is this is fake anyways but uh, inevitably i went on instagram like a couple of minutes later and i and i saw all the posts and then a, the official statement came on to the news and um i was devastated i was i was i was genuinely shocked like i can't explain it because he was I, he, he was my favorite actor like he was my he was the he was he was such a good actor i don't know he was such a good actor man and it feels like a really 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 feels like a real loss um but anyways uh let's not dwell upon that uh, i don't even want to talk about it too much what i do want to talk about is is the topic of this video is mental health now the statement that was released by uh i think the i think the police or i don't know i just, i saw in the news somewhere uh is that he was suffering through a lot of depression for the past couple of years um and it's because of mental health issues something like that that caused him to commit a uh, suicide um and i don't know i just i don't i don't know if that's true obviously cuz it's not an official official statement of what i read it's just what i read but uh, they had they used to i don't know there used to be a quite a lot of talks of him going through depression and stuff during you know during during his time um obviously you don't really know how much is true how much is not because it's 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 the media right so you just got to got to take everything with a pinch of salt but um i don't know i i, I won't be surprised i won't be surprised cuz there's a lot of cases nowadays that you know about the whole depression and the whole mental health thing and um it seems like a legit thing and and it, and that's where my point is it should it should it should have always been a legit thing and for some reason it isn't it's mental health is it's very very overlooked um like it's something that people just don't talk about like you see you 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 heard about like you know physical health uh, all of that all of that stuff or oh, you know you're obese or let's say you know you're overweight you got you got you got you got to sort that out um, i don't know you you got diabetes you got this you got that all of that physical the physical aspect is always to it always shoved into our faces but the mental health aspect is not and it's not given as much importance and i think it's more important really because mental health your your mental mindset your mental the way you think about stuff is is what are 99.9% impact of what every what you do everything around you like your mental health directly impacts your physical health i think and cuz I, I, i don't i don't i don't understand like why is it not talked about too much because 
um, I don't know if it, I don't know if it's it's just me who's experienced it, but I just feel like it's just not talked about a lot, especially, especially in the Indian uh, Indian house. Or like, okay, I'm not gonna be bashing anyone. I'm not bashing anyone here. So if you if you feel like I'm, I've I've offended you, I'm again I'm really sorry about that in advance. But no, I'm not bashing anyone. But this is something that I've really observed, uh, especially in the Indian household, in the Indian community, uh, and that that I've been a part in at least. Um, I've observed this only. <laughs> again, I stress that I've observed. I'm, I'm not. I'm not. Uh, bashing anyone but what I've observed is is that this this whole stress mental depression and every mental like mental health thing it's not really talked about in the Indian household like it's it, it's something that doesn't exist um, let, me, let me give you some context really okay quickly so uh, in, in, in Indian household and this is something that's commonly joked about the Indian uh, community that in Indian household you're either a lawyer you're an engineer a doctor or a failure there's no other alternative. Like if you if you if you choose a career option other other than those three, you're considered a failure. And yeah, that's that's like that's like a joke. I mean, obviously it's a, it's a joke, but um, it's very true. It's very true. I think personally because I've observed it. Luckily, I haven't. I'm not in a family like that. Oh, I'm I'm so lucky. Like my parents have been really supportive of everything I have done so far, and I'm I'm super super grateful for that. But um, but yeah, it is thing. It is a, it is a common thing that occurs in Indian households. Um, and the thing is, the thing what happens is that the kid of the household is it he, he, he just gets shoved into this uh, industry. Like let's say he wants to do engineering, like he, he he just gets shoved into like engineering. Let's say he doesn't want to do it. He wants to do art, or he wants to, you know, do photography, or he wants to do like filmmaking, or I don't know. He wants to run a bit or something. He wants to do something, but not that. But he gets shoved into that regardless, and that's where it starts. That's where it starts, and. Um, and it's just if you, if 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 the if the kid goes to his uh, parents or anyone says like I don't want to do this I'm feeling depressed all the time it, they're not listened to like no one listens to them and that yeah, I think really bad like that's where it starts and that's it it, it grows slow it, it's very slow but it comes a point when it completely engrosses you and you just feel like there's no point in life like there's no what's the point what am I even doing what is the point to all this and and stuff like this happens and um i don't know it's just it's just it's crazy like i've i've seen this whole thing firsthand i don't really talk about it too much like i've actually too much i think after i haven't talked about this to anyone uh which i which are looking back i should have done because it would have helped me get through it a lot quicker uh luckily my depression thing wasn't it, it, it's a very slow thing I, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't even really call it depression it was like a bad f phase i don't really know the definitions of all this stuff uh i'm a simple guy so um I was going through a bad phase a couple of years ago and oh, luckily it didn't last for too long and the whole depression thing and the whole de being depressed and everything didn't really last for too long but I was a lucky one and some people it doesn't last like a short time it lasts a very long time until you know the time it engrosses you and everything and you just pretty much uh, yeah so I don't know I don't really know mental health is a really it's, it's, it's a really it's a really overlooked topic, man. It's just it's it's just something that shouldn't be overlooked, but it really is. So, yeah, I don't know. Anyways, I don't really know where I was going with this topic. Really, I just wanted to quickly make this video and just put it on. To you. I don't even know how long I'm gonna keep this on YouTube. Uh, but um, let's see. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I know it wasn't really like a normal video that you that I do, but sometimes you just wanna share some stuff and. Uh, that's just what I wanted to do. So, yeah. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one in a more of a lighter topic, hopefully. But, yeah. Until then, bye-bye.